What's going on friends and welcome back to the Minecraft Hub channel. In today's video, we are going to be showcasing five amazing mega bases built in Minecraft survival. So to start things off, the first mega base we're checking out here is from my boy Vesco. A lot of you guys have probably seen this design because Mumbo Jumbo took inspiration for this in his Hermitcraft season seven base. And he's also shown this off on his channel before, but nonetheless, one of the coolest and most unique designs I've seen that a lot of people adopted into their building. And the fact he did this all in a hardcore world makes it insanely, insanely impressive. Now the next mega base here is actually coming from my boy Fit MC. A lot of you guys probably know him if you follow 2B2T. And what's awesome about this is the base is actually built in the end, which you don't really see too often. And what also makes this just as impressive, although it's not in hardcore Minecraft, the reason I'm including it in this video is because it was built on the 2B2T server where there is literally no rules. It's an anarchy server, as many of you guys probably know. So this base, whenever it was found, could be easily griefed and destroyed basically to where it didn't even look like it existed. So the fact they put this much time and effort into this insane Insanely, insanely detailed base on this server makes it just as impressive as if it was built in a hardcore world. Now this next base here is actually coming from a YouTuber known as Whistler N97 and this build was built in a hardcore world and what's awesome about this and what I really love about this design is it's kind of like a pyramid scheme where it's all one giant box and it has different tiers but a lot of the elements are different than a regular base old pyramid that honestly gets pretty boring because a lot of people have built them in Minecraft. So I love the design, it turned out amazing, the fact that it's all made out of stone as well makes it look very awesome.
Now, the next base that we're looking at is coming from another YouTuber known as Meg Ray, and this base is really cool because it was built in a jungle biome, and I really do like the concept of having a massive dome over the top and the rest of it kind of being built underground. There was a lot of digging and excavating, and I feel like just flying over this base with an elytra would look absolutely stunning. She did a really good job with the design, making it look really natural, adding trees and scenery to fit in with the jungle biome, and I absolutely love the base. Now for the final mega base of this video, it's coming from X Picky X, and again, this base is very similar to Vesco's in the fact that this was built out in the middle of the ocean. I feel like ocean bases are very, very underrated because there is a lot of work to be done. He clearly had to use a bunch of sponge and sand to remove a ton of water, and overall, the color scheme, the block palette, and everything that he did with this base looks very, very nice, and I think it turned out really well, especially because it's just standing out alone in the ocean. It looks absolutely beautiful. Beautiful. 